What is up, fam? Hope this message finds you all well in great spirits. Gotta, gotta talk about what's going on right now. You have sent me messages requesting, what is this report about the 2028 model year being the end of the Mustang? <laughs> Listen, I'm shocked too when I read it and I gotta talk to you about what I know, what it means, and, and I have hit up my contacts before. So we're gonna find out what is going on. And guys, this is a season of giving. This video is brought to you by the Centennial Shelby Mustang. They have built one, the Shelby Club of America. Support a good cause. All you gotta do, link in description. Use my code STANGMODE at 40. It already populates for you. It's pinned to the comments. You click it, you grab it, you check it out. It ends in just a few days, December 10th. So your chance to win a supercharged Whipple stick shift 2023 Shelby Mustang. Use my code, ends in a few days, link in the description, check it out and appreciate them for, you know, uh, helping us out because the Stang Mode community has a better chance to enter with Stang Mode 40 plus entries. All right, so let's talk about what's going on with this report. Uh, as you know, the strike has been settled and people are getting back to business now. And one of the reports that came out was that 2028 will be the last model year for the Mustang. Now, we just got it. <laughs> I'm driving the dark horse. What does this mean? Um, I can tell you right now that there is a lot of confusion going on because what it means is this could be the last model year for the S650. If you recall, four or five years, it's 2023 right now, but five years from now, we could see the model refresh. And I did a live stream, you could check it out, where there was already approval for another Coyote Mustang to be coming. Um, the Mustang's not going anywhere. That report is incorrect. Um, I had a chance to reach out, and even Ford commented that that is an incorrect report. The Mustang's not going anywhere, but what does that mean for the Mustang going forward, right? Like, what what is, where there's smoke, there's always some fire, right? What is to that? Does that mean that we're gonna be the end of ICE Mustangs in 2028? Um, no, what that means is we're probably gonna get the S750, which is the next design of the Mustang. And we have heard from the CEO Farley that we're not probably gonna see a uh, full EV coupe Mustang yet because what that will do is that would take away sales from the Maki -E SUV Mustang, right? So we're gonna be seeing more hybrid variants of Mustangs coming to fruition because that helps keep the EPA regulations at bay with the fuel economy. And of course, what that means is with hybrid, you could be seeing all wheel drive Mustangs coming up, um, which I think is pretty cool and also pretty exciting to talk about. But you have to take everything with a grain of salt because everything is fluid. Things change, laws changes, but what we do have to talk about is the fact that right now, EVs aren't selling at the clip that was once forecasted. So we can see a scenario where the EVs are gonna make room for more hybrids because right now, the infrastructure still isn't there to completely cut off gas altogether. People, especially Americans like myself, uh, I can't sit at the charging port for 30, 40 minutes to charge my vehicle, right? I think even Tesla's 15, 20 minutes. That's a long time. I like to be in and out of the gas station in a few minutes. Maybe take a couple Instagram pictures and move on. But what we do know is for the here and now, what that means is like we talked about in a live stream, there's gonna be a boatload, a you know what ton of S650 variant specialty models coming out, especially with Mustang's 60th birthday coming out next year, April, 2024. Expect a lot of fun. We already talked about the new Shelby or potentially Cobra R coming out. We have the Boss. There's so many more nameplates, so many more designs. And of course, the King Daddy Mustang GTD is coming. So there's a lot of fun to be had in the Mustang community. But I can faithfully say that, yes, this is not true. Mustang will continue. It potentially, the only thing that could end is the ICE motors. But I have it on good authority that we're going to get a 5th Gen 5.0. Um, it's such a good motor. The 5.0 is so reliable, so fast. That's kind of why they went away from the Voodoo. Um, we all know about the oil consumption and whatnot if you guys follow the channel or have 350s yourself. Um, the Coyote is just, that is a coup de grace motor for Ford, especially for performance in the Mustang. 
Um, it just loves boost, it's efficient, it's great, and they last. So the 2028 will be the S750, fifth gen 5.0 and hybrid Mustangs and redesign. Not ground up redesign, but redesign, refresh. Um, and then we'll go from there. So from what I understand and what I know, the Mustang is not being killed off or dying in 2028. The Mustang's not gonna ever go anywhere, especially this, the coupe or sports car, it ain't happening. Um, but what we do know, there will be an evolution where we'll always have a Mustang coupe, but we may have eventually Mustang hybrid and eventually I would say probably 20, 20 30 and beyond, maybe an EV coupe because most generation runs are eight years. So you go, 2015 to 2023 was S550, that's eight years. So 2024 Mustang plus eight is 2032. So what you can see is we'll probably get a refresh in between like we did with the 2018 Mustang to 2015. And that's when you find out and that's when you see that you have the 2028 year. That's where there was some confusion, but 2028 will be the refresh and uh, new style, new design, new interior for some of you people who don't expect anything crazy, but some people don't like the iPad screens, there could be a little bit of an update there, but you'll see that in four years or so. But the here and now, right now, is exciting because what that means is, like I said, we're gonna get a ton and a, fun, a lot of fun in the new models and variants coming out with the S650. And yes, I know you guys are waiting. I'm waiting too. My Whipple is on the way. We're waiting for it. I know you're also waiting for tuning. So tuning is coming too. I will keep you posted as I know you will know, but I wanted to just put this kind of conversation out there for the people in the in Stang Mode community who were asking me, uh, sorry, we're going over bumps, and uh, it's kind of crazy, Jersey Road sucks, but that's besides the point, who were asking me, like, is this true, what do you know, so yes, that's what I know, that's what we'll find out, and we'll go from there. All right, you guys, I appreciate the support, and please like and subscribe, and this guy's trying to hit me. <laughs> let me get, let me get home. It's winter time and people are just going a little crazy during Christmas season. Like and subscribe because you know it never ends. Peace. Yeah, that was a good race.